We have the great honor to have a very, very distinguished speaker coming up next. She is a very successful lawyer and has been also a very successful politician. She was elected twice commissioner at the European Commission, first as Commissioner for Health in 2008, and then she is now, again, Commissioner, serving Commissioner for Education, Culture, Multilingualism, Youth and Sport. Over her distinguished career, she has certainly furthered the cause for women in politics, sports, and also business. She has been a great supporter of this particular conference and of the IWG. Please give a warm welcome to Ms. Andrula Vasiliou. Madam President, great leaders and friends of sport, I must say that I do regret that I didn't have the pleasure to participate in the previous IWG conferences, but I am delighted to participate in this one. I'm delighted that 20 years after the World Conference on Women and Sport is back in Europe. What started as a big success in Brighton in 1994 is now resuming here in Helsinki. I congratulate Finland on this excellent initiative. I am proud that the conference is taking place in a member state of the European Union. Much of what we do together in the EU is based on the idea that we can always learn from others, that mutual exchange can be a spur to innovation. And I'm confident that this, confident that this conference will also reflect that spirit. I'm happy to see you all here so that we can learn from your experiences. European sport can benefit from your good practices in the field of gender equality in sport. Your success stories from across the world can serve as inspiration for us to define strategic actions that achieve real equality between women and men. But of course, I hope you can learn also from us, the birthplace of so many sports and excellent programs, the region where the Brighton Declaration was endorsed. The combined efforts of all of you at this conference will contribute to a further change in the field of sport, bringing more equality and thereby also more quality in sport. Do not forget that although your starting point is sport, what you do goes much further. Together you have created a community focused on fighting gender stereotypes and accepting diversity and equality not only in sport, but also in society as a whole. The EU is built on the values you represent, equality, non-discrimination, excellence, which is why we are so proud to be a patron of this great conference and are committed to contribute to actions improving gender equality in sport. The long days of preparation are over. Now the real thing is about to begin. In sport, as in life, taking part is everything. But results count, and you can count me in. Good luck to everyone, and be the change. Thank you.